Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Brentford facing Manchester City. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And here's the starting 11 for Brentford. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Phil Foden plays with Jack Grealish in the wide positions. And the lone striker today is Erling Haaland. Thank you. Enjoy the game. Potentially exciting 90 minutes here, and Manchester City get the ball rolling. Holland. And Bernardo Silva has it. On to Grealish. Can they convert? Oh, that is a majestic goal! Volleyed home with precision and style. Superbly done. Well, here we can see just how good the cross from Grealish was. And then just look at this finish, Derek. He does so well to read the bounce. Often you can send these into row Z, but he makes the perfect contact. Stunning goal, really. And they're playing once again. Manchester City with the advantage. Over the touchline for what will be a Brentford throw. Christian Nurgard. Well, not giving the opposition a look in. That strong play. Johan Wiesa. And the ball back with City now. De Bruyne. Mbermo. A gift for any goalkeeper. Running with the ball confidently. Goalkeeper doing his job, getting the touch. Corner kick forthcoming. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, the danger is still there. Johan Wiesa. He read the situation defensively and did his job. De Bruyne. Plenty of support here. Walker. Now with Grealish. Foden. On to De Bruyne. Walker. On to Silva. Can they find a gap in the defence? And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Oh. 
Ruben Dias. Phil Foden now. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Cancelo. He takes aim. Terrific block. Really good high press. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Joao Cancelo. Grealish. On to Silva. Foden. It's gone in! Well, they're really in the mood here. Can they be stopped? Let's have a look at the replay. What a through ball this is by Haaland. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Two-nil here, and the ball is moving again. An effective ball. Good play it in. Nicely timed tackle. Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Well, no stopping him. Not the pass he had in mind. He's in here. And waiting for a team. Opportunity. A goal! They're absolutely racing away with this. Three to the good now. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, we know what Erling Haaland is capable of, but it's still difficult trying to contain him as the opposition have found out here. Well, he's been a joy to watch so far. He's got so much ability, and it was also a very good finish for his goal. He's been excellent. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. And threading it forward. Well, that's one for them to pursue. Oh, moving it nicely. And attempting the through ball. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Number 20, Bernardo Silva, to be replaced by number 8, Ilkay Dundawan.
Can he take advantage? And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. Who can they pick out? It hasn't come to very much. He's in control of the situation. Well, a poor effort when all was said and done, and simple for the keeper. Well, he's made a real mess of that, hasn't he? What a chance that was. 30 minutes to go, then. And the right place to cut out the pass. De Bruyne. And still danger here. Holland. Foden. Oh, great defending. Well, what a brilliant save that was. How did he keep that out? Well, not out of the woods just yet. This... Oh, wonderful save! Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. Number eight, Matthias Jensen, to be replaced by number 10, Josh De Silva. Substitution for Manchester City. Coming off the pitch, number 47, Phil Foden. To be well, opting for the short corner. Laporte and now Rodri it's with Laporte well a top-notch piece of defensive judgment just 20 minutes remaining now Aaron Hickey just the challenge that was required Counter-attacking, very much an option. Happy birthday, Tony. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? He's protecting it effectively. Mares. And return to De Bruyne. And offside by the merest of margins. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Substitution for Manchester City. Coming off the pitch, number two, Kyle Walker. Coming onto the pitch, number five, John Stones. And City have possession once more. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. And time for the change now. Number three, Rico Henry. Coming onto the pitch, number 16, Ben Mee. It's a short one. Gundogan. Breaking at pace. They need to get bodies back. Defenders understanding their roles. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Trying to pick out a teammate. Oh, splendid header, but a fine save. Corner once more. And now the delivery. 
Growing pressure here, and another corner. Let's see about the delivery. Well, he didn't miss by a huge margin, did he? Well, this is far from over. We're going to have five minutes of stoppage time. Losing possession a bit easily. Bodies forward and the break looks on. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. You're absolutely right, Derek. While the result is poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best at every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improving before the next time out. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him.